There's a saying, I believe it's a Chinese saying, that if you want to go fast, you go by yourself, you go alone. But if you want to go far, then you go with others. One of the wonderful things about discipleship, the wonderful things about being fruitful in the work of God, is that you don't have to do this alone. God has called us to do this in community, to do it together. That's what we want to talk about for a few moments here on CETAM Church Online. My name is Reverend Kwame Rubadiri. One of the great principles that we see in the whole disciple-making process from the Word of God and through all of the experiences of the growth of the church in the Bible is that everything was done in groups. Jesus called a group of men around him, 12 men who stayed with him for three years. That number grew to 70, 72, ultimately to 120, later on to 500, to 3,000, to even more. There was this amazing expansion as people were added to the faith and came to the body of Christ and that they began to live out their lives in a way that honored God. They began to show what a true disciple, follower of the Lord Jesus Christ looked like. As they began to live out their lives, one of the things that they were encouraged to do on a regular basis was to get together, was to meet, was to reach out to one another and to help one another, to share one another's needs and to meet one another's needs. They were breaking bread together. They were involved in sharing the things that they had. Those who were wealthy helped those who were not as wealthy. Those who had food helped those who didn't have as much food. And it was this wonderful, amazing ministry of care that helped the church to expand, to grow, and to give one of the most important hallmarks of discipleship. And that is the whole area of fellowship coming together. This is what the Word of God says in Hebrews chapter 10, verse 25. Not giving up meeting together. Don't neglect meeting together, as some have in the habit of doing. Encourage one another, all the more as you see the day of the Lord approaching. This is something God wants us to do on a regular basis. Discipleship is personal and it is important. All of us must work on our relationship with the Lord Jesus Christ daily. But we do the work of God. We do the work and the of growth, the work of maturing in concert. We do it together. There is no person who matures on their own, their own. We mature in family, we mature in groups. We grow because God puts other people in our lives who help us to grow. So I want to encourage you, don't neglect being in a part of a church, don't neglect being part of a small group, and don't neglect being part of a group that helps to grow others together. That's my hope for all of us, and I pray that you will do it well. God bless you.